Good morning. I just thought I'd do a Monday vlog. Why not? This is my coffin number two. So, and I just love these Dollar Tree mugs. They're the perfect size. Great handle. <laughs> and I like the saying. So, got my little station. I'm on decaf, half calf, not decaf. I hardly ever, because I don't like to drink too much liquids at night, you know. So, you get older, you go to the bathroom all the time. And out here, I don't know if you can see. My little squirrel friend. I didn't see the um, bunny yesterday. I did have Margaret and Roxanne over. I didn't do a video, sorry. We get into a zone and it's just, look at him. Let me go. Oh my goodness. This is day, I put out so much seed that it lasts a couple days. But if I don't feed them, they start attacking the bird feeders. So it's like, yeah, gotta do it, gotta do it. So I'm pretty well cleaned up. Loving this new tablecloth. Cleaned up from yesterday. Um, that I got, doesn't it look like, it was on Timu. And I, it looks so much like, oops, sorry, Pioneer Woman. I mean, come on. It is like a... It's a polyester, but I don't mind that in other things. I just can't wear it. <laughs> so today my goal is to take down, I don't know if I'll get to it yet, but I need to get put away my Easter. I just like it so much. So, you know, and again, live alone. So I did leave up from yesterday my one of my tables. I put two of these in the room and then the chairs and a waste paper basket, but I'm going to be working here on um i have a cricket joy extra now anyway I, and i've been doing i need to finish up the banner for tori's party i got some pretty i like to do these screen savers i haven't done it in a long time so i thought i'd look it up let's see what the birds are up to out here so kind of a rainy day i'm gonna get out here pretty soon before the rain's supposed to start they say at 10 so i want to give coco a walk and I need a walk too. So Margaret and I went for a walk yesterday. This weekend, I, um, Brian and I, we had pizza together. He treated me since I've been taking care of Coco so much while he's at work. And Emma and Kristen are gone. So, yeah. That was fun. Anytime you can be with your kids is a good thing, right? And, uh, yeah. So I'm going to be starting out <clears throat> today and um, coming on once in a while again. Don't have big plans. I read somewhere or watched somebody's on T-Talk, TikTok, I believe, that said about retirement, don't plan things on Monday. It's a calm day. It should be your calm day after a weekend. I was like, oh, I like that. So hopefully the bunny will visit again. I miss the bunny. I just love my backyard. Very blessed to live where I do. All right, let's go upstairs. I'm going to take my coffee up, get ready for the day. And you can see my mess. Yeah, it's a mess. These are steep stairs. That's the only downfall of this place is as I get older, this worries me as, you know, how long can I do? I haven't made my bed yet. And this is all the stuff I need to film and stuff. <laughs> but I wanted it out of the way for yesterday, so... Yeah. Oops. I didn't need to do that. Why did I do that? Hang on. All right. I wanted to show you. I did make this tower of the planters. And I found this at Dollar Tree. So that works. And I had to have something underneath because this would scoot around. I think the originator used a smaller one. I'll show you that in a minute. But I'm putting my paint pens, paints, brushes, just odds and ends. It holds a lot. Paint markers. And then if it's me, I'm hoping if it's next to me, I'll use it. Gel pens. These are all my metallic type pens. These kind of things. So, yeah. I mean, it's big, right? Obviously. Sharpies. So, yeah. But... My room is such a disaster. Anyway, there is this size, the smaller one. And they have actually 
little cups, but I didn't discover those and I'd already bought some of these. So I may go back and get the tan ones, but this is the smaller one and it does fit inside the turntable. So there you go. Tips by Kim. Oops, my camera's kind of crooked. Hopefully I can. So yeah, I'm working on this spread. That one's done. Let me show you. I'll probably do a video about it. I don't know if I did. I know. I think I showed this one, but this is this other page I did. And this is Simple Stories. So there they are with... Who I don't know who that is. I know that's Cinderella. So I have some stickers, and I use this as a flap. Isn't this the sweetest look at their little faces greeting her? Oh, my gosh. Just adorables. So that's a good way to do it, is just to have little flaps. And this was a cut-apart journaling card type thing. And I turned it into a flap. So there we go. Got some more done. All right, I'm going to be brave and show you. <laughs> anyway, here's my, I use, I was showing, and I thought it was recording and it wasn't, but I get most of my makeup from Laura Geller. This is eyebrow. But the main thing I love, and if you're older, this stuff works really good, doesn't, you know, heavy or is her baked because it's got the yellows and things in there different tones obviously you can tell i use this a lot and this is the baked balance and brighten fair she has awesome this is the one i go over everything once i'm done and it just kind of smooths and really covers i've got you know as you get older you got it sucks getting older ain't for sissies you get to see the real me here and I love her eyeliner. I don't wear, I have very thin lashes and they bo mascara bothers me. So I wear this and it lasts all day. Let's see here. I did use, I've been buying this primer I, or I bought it from Be Pure. She also, Laura Geller being she, has it from as well, a primer. But this is in my bag, so I'm going to use it. So yeah, it's a Monday, as I said earlier on my, I'm trying to do a vlog again, no big plans. Gotta get the birthday party stuff. I did wash my brushes last night, and some of them are still damp, so they're not. This is the one I usually use to put on this. Anyway, okay, get ready, Kim. Can't do this all day. It's taking too long, so I'm drawing my eyebrows. Because they are... Also, thin, you know, like, I don't know. I got a few issues I'm going to talk to God about when I get up to heaven if I get there. Uh, and one of them is, okay, women go through so much earlier in life, and then we get hair on our face afterwards. And then thin hair, like eyebrows and stuff. So it's like, it doesn't make any sense. So what's up with that, God? I mean, I like the thinny. I don't have as much. I don't have to shave my legs as much. That's a plus. That I like. I'll compliment him on that. But it's like, come on. Really? You're probably like, okay, Kim, what are you talking about? Okay, so. Let's put a little of this on. But yeah, I recommend Laura Geller. It's not cheap but it lasts i can have some of our foundation the baked and brighten and all that stuff it lasts over a year so you get your money's worth and she, if you join you know subscribe to her become a member or whatever for free you get um great deals she always has good deals let's see let's get out Oh yeah, I'm gonna go over and take little Miss Coco for a walk, and that'll be nice. I gotta get over there before the rain. I know we will not in Washington. One, it's super cloudy and rainy today, but we will not be in the line of totality. So if you are watching the eclipse today, how fun is that? That's pretty cool. But no, we're not. And I use some of the 
wash up here. Give me some little color. Okay. But yeah. She has all kinds of... Sometimes it feel... Oh! Oh! Jeez! See? Something always happens. Sorry, ladies. Um, This is really pretty, too. It's more um, sparkly. If you're feeling sparkly. Oh, here's her primer. I had it down here. It's called Spackle. If you're wondering. I don't know if that's focusing. It's still right there. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't. <laughs> it doesn't look focused to me because I can't see. I can't see. I have been using this. There's another one out that's very popular and on Facebook all the time and on YouTube commercials. But it's kind of expensive, so I gave this a try, and it's called Bay Free. Well, you can read it. I can't. Okay, Bay Free. It's just a little cream. I don't, like I said, I don't do much. I don't do much. I'm going to be at Emma's school. See, this one really it's still wet, though. Let's blend it in. Just give myself a little color there. And on Laura Geller's site, she will show you tips on applying makeup, so that's nice. Yeah, see, these are all wet. Okay. I don't usually brush wash my brushes, but I thought, well, I should. So I did. So I'm here doing my evening routine, waking myself up. I get on TikTok and oh my lord. It's like I stay up way later than I had planned. So but like I said, I think I wake myself up with from applying this. It just kind of blends everything, smooths it out. So, yes, Laura Geller. That's my makeup of choice. I saw it on TikTok. It's like going crazy. So, But I've been with her for probably 15 years or more. So, anywho... And I use other things, obviously. So now it's time. I run the water to get it warm because I'm going to spray out my... This is the water pick I have. I don't know if I'll include this part. I mean, seriously. <coughs> oh! <laughs> I'll have to show you later what Lucille Ball did the other morning. Oh my god, I'm so scared. Oh my god. Almost ruined my eyes. So there's that. And I think this is, I gotta put my glasses. I literally, I can't read it. I can see this, but I can't read it. Sonic Phillips. And this, if you wanna go to your dentist and ask them to give you. This is what they prescribed. It was like $11, which isn't too bad, but it's worth it if it's going to save my... I've already flossed earlier downstairs. So I take vitamin D because I live in the Northwest and I don't get a lot of vitamin D most of the year. Plus I craft indoors, which is, I take biotin, it helps nail growth, hair growth. If I could put my glasses on now, that would probably help me. And B12. I put it all in this little, I think I got that at Dollar Tree a long time ago. <clears throat> I 
I used to tease my parents saying their morning pills was like a meal, and here I am. I have um, eyesight issues in my family, macular degeneration, so I'm trying to ward it off, and it's pearl vision. And I finally found, it used to be they made it with um, yellow dye, Lake number six, and that makes me break out in hives, but they don't anymore. Thank God. And a couple prescriptions. Don't need to know what those are for. Give it Brian and just say. <laughs> oh my gosh. And if you have allergies or anything, um, Flonase. My doctor said this is actually better than more strong and more effective than most of the pills and stuff. So I'm going to step off the head because it's embarrassing. Why, but I don't want you to see me sticking stuff up my nose. Okay, here we go. I take my pills for my coffee. Do you put the liquid in first and then the pill? Well, you know, or do you put the pills like I just did and then take a drink? I don't see how you would do it the other way, but somebody was saying they did. So. Mm -hmm. I did take a, did I take, I put everything outside here so that I remember what I put in there. Oh, and I need to do this. So this is just antiseptic. I think it's compared to Listerine. Somebody was asking and I just got the Safeway brand. It's quite the process anyway. And I will do a lot of powder. I do use it with uh, cornstarch. But I have, and I swear, it looks like it snowed in here. It's crazy. But I gotta have my powder. Ooh, and I use, I just get this at Dollar Tree, and it is aluminum free, which is supposed to, it's important. Okay. Here is what happened to me a couple mornings ago. I think it was Saturday morning. So I didn't have my glasses on, as you saw earlier in the clip. I can see things, you know, I have bifocals. It's, I'm not blind or anything, but it's... Anywho, and it was early, I hadn't had my coffee yet, and I put, um, for my, I had some issues, and the nail gal told me to put this antifungal in there, and it's cleared it up. Okay. And I also had right next to it in purple, these eye drops. Yeah. I grabbed these antifungal and dropped it into my eye. I'm like, and oh, the burn was unbelievable. And I'm like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. So I went and flushed out my eye. It was so red and I could barely, I couldn't even open it. And I'm thinking I'm going to have to go to the emergency room. What do I do? So I kept flushing it and then I put in this and other I just kept dropping and flushing and doo -doo -doo, so it got better but so Margaret and Roxanne said so what are you gonna do about that how are you gonna keep from doing that again I said well one I will be careful to look <laughs> but look at that and I said to Roxanne I go what happened to the Mr. Yuck stickers, the poison, big green ones, they wouldn't even fit on here. But she goes, can you have enough stuff in your craft room and stash that you could make your own something to make these? So, yeah, I keep one in here now, and I keep this normally in my bathroom. So I keep them a separate. Oh, my gosh, you guys. Lucille Ball, I tell ya. So, going to get ready for the day, and I will bring you along. So, wanted to show you, I got this at, in the men's section, they had those carousels with the t-shirts on it. I don't know what man would want this shirt, but I was like, I do, Barbie. Now, I bought it in a large, and it was a little, a little tight, so I went back, and they were $8.98 or something, and got this extra large. I just like my stuff loose. I'm not trying to show the girls or anything. I'm not trying to track anybody. So, yeah. Isn't that cute? And they're nice cotton. So yeah, 100% cotton. So I am fine in it. I don't get hot. 
Just wanted to show you that. That's what I'm going to wear today. Okay. Got to go down and make my bar toast. And then I'll take Miss Coco for her walk. Oh, did I already? I don't know. I'm going for I think I toasted it earlier and forgot I put it in there. Say so, nope, no bunnies, no nobody visiting right now. Isn't that pretty though? I just love my windows and my blessed my coffee. I'm a coffee girl in the mornings. I try not to spoil myself. There's a good stand where I like the girls that work there um, down the road. But, you know, it gets expensive. So I'm trying to limit, limit it. Peanut butter. And I think I got this. I've already used it. When that jar gets low, like in the peanut butter, I don't want to waste it all. This thing goes in there and digs on through, but I need to clean it. I haven't cleaned it. I was going to just dishwasher it. There we go. So I use this when the jar gets low. I don't want to waste all that. So I use this. Just a suggestion. I bought toast and I do not hold back on peanut butter or jam. I made this yesterday. It looks terrible. It was from the cake doctor I've been trying to use. But I was supposed to, I'm going to start baking and cooking more. And I, it's a yellow cake mix, fresh blueberries, but I mixed the blueberries in. It was supposed to go on top and it would have been much prettier, but it tastes awesome. Some of the things I worked on yesterday, I had, you'd already seen this and I'll show these again in another video, but so I did this witch again, only using my Spectrum Noirs. And the reason I like Copic coloring or alcohol markers is the vibrant color. So there's that. These are those famous Diana Markham. And then I've also gotten in an order from KS Crafts. I need to take the Bozer Darling, but I can't get them to, I need to get a glue gun, I guess. I ordered her latest set because it's all, most of it was um, Disney type theme. So I did this. Cute. This is the bag topper, but I think I'll just use it, you know, as an endor you know, embellish endorsement. But I'm working on the bow, but it just keeps. <laughs> well, I'll share that when it's done and some more stuff. And you have my bar toast and my coffee fee. Coffee just this is it this is where I Roxanne came over and she goes boy you've settled in down here I go oh yeah my screensaver on that pretty it's just airy and I can see my birds and stuff down here I think that's why I like it down here so I do my card making down here other projects upstairs so like I said it's a craft house I got to share this I have that other stamp and I did this. I kind of regret going around with purple, but I wanted it to look like she was out at night. I don't know. Anyway, but I made her green. She looks like she'd be a green witch. And look at the cat. So I think I did okay, but like I said, but I did get scrapbook.com. Their new sparkle colors, and one of them was purple. So I don't know if you can tell. The lighting's not too good. But her hair's got sparkle in it. And then I used a green sparkle on her face. We're gonna go play ball. I do have a chuck it, so she just <laughs> out, 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 out. No jump. Oops, sorry. There she goes. <gasps> what you gonna do? Huh? Are you gonna play ball, with Grandma? You gonna play ball, with Grandma? There she goes. 
she goes. Let's see if I can. Sometimes the balls are too big and they don't come out. Yep, see. So gotta have it part way out. She's down there alone. What are you doing, Grandma? It's a rainy day. The old PNW. So I've got a hooded sweatshirt on. Pink to go with my Barbie. Where'd you go, Coco? Where'd you go? Huh? Where'd you go? Get the ball. Get the ball. Go get it. First ball she ever <laughs> bring the to me. Come on. Oh, good girl. Checked out Dollar Tree. I did ask when is the new shipments in and they said Tuesday, but they start getting it out on the next two days. So, because man, they are slow-mo in this one. All right, I step, stepped, stopped into Dollar Tree really quick. So I just wanted earlier in this vlog, I'm showing you, so I got more of the little stand I made. So these cups are perfect for the smaller size planters. I need to prune my hydrangea, so I got that. I did plant some stuff and the gal that I rent from was fine with that. So I want to take care of that. More of these. Somebody said they use them for paper clips. I was like, oh, that's awesome. Okay, I got one for the girls, but I wanted one for me. Isn't that the cutest? Oh my gosh. Just for at the house for Emma, whoever's there. And I've seen this book a couple times. I decided to get it. What You Wish For. Got good reviews from Jody Pico. I think that's how you say her name. And different people. New York Best Times Best Selling Author. How to Walk Away and Things You Save in a Fire. But it's not a self help book, it's actually a fiction story type. And I got more of these. These foldable. These are great. These are going to be perfect for my trailer. So that's all I got in there. But I just wanted to share. Okay, I'm back home. Took a nap. <laughs> I got up too early. I don't know. Anyway, so I did my nappy. That's what I do. Had a little lunch. But <laughs> after I went to Dollar Tree, there is a local thrift store. And I haven't been there for like forever. It's tiny. But they were really well stocked. And look what I found. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh, and it was Mystery Monday coupon day. Well, I didn't know that either. This is a new thing. So I got a 20% off coupon. It was $8.99, but it is Pioneer Woman. I have a utensil thing, but not a Pioneer Woman one. So I'll be replacing. Oh my gosh. I just love it. It's in great condition. It's sticky and stuff, so I need to wash it. But yeah. That was the, the prize. I got a couple other things, but I wanted to share that. So what I'm going to be doing is, I didn't tell you guys, but I did get, I was kind of embarrassed, just being honest. And I also, a while back, and I'm finally using it off and on, I have the Cricut Joy. I have the Cricut Maker. Yeah. But I got the Cricut Joy Extra, because and on the Maker, you can also make um, stickers, but you can make sticker sheets and things done that yet but you know I could if I wanted anyway I like it because it's portable again and it's a little bit bigger it's a size that it used to be the opening 
of the original Cricut, which of course I own that too. Uh, let's see, easy printable sensors. I don't know if it tells measurements, but this is what I got it on HSM. Let's see. <clears throat> Easy printable, but ba up. Writes and draws, makes projects up to eight and a half by eleven. So I thought for computer or computer. Yeah, I need another nap. Calendars and such, you know. So I've got some more mats um, for this, and I am going to be working on the banner. So I'll bring you along with that too. Okay, I moved you because the lighting was bad. So I got out. I've already cut a bunch of. The parts to the banner and I think I've shared this this is gonna be the some of the gems fell off what the banner looks like but this I probably will I'm gonna redo this one it's kind of mucked up but I just wanted to get it an idea of where I was going with this before I started actually making the banner okay I thought I would bring you guys along for at least a first cut just kind of the steps of if you're I've had people ask about to share how to use the Cricut Joy the Cricut Joy Extra is exactly the same operations, it's just bigger. So don't feel like, oh, this doesn't apply um, because you want the Cricut Joy. This is the Cricut Joy Extra. Yes. So I did a sample. I'm going to change it up a bit. These are letters I got on clearance at Hobby Lobby. Got the crown at the top. So this would be the H for happy, but I think I'm, yeah, I was just playing around with it. I did, I'm using glitter paper from Recollections, Michaels. I've got different shades here, and I think that'll kind of be pretty to just do different. And I'm going to do the base. I also have cut out a pink base, a whole bunch of them. So I could use that as well to glue the glitter paper if I decide. Okay, so let's try this out. <clears throat> when you get a new mat... You kind of want to pat around on it to kind of, it's, they're very sticky and it's hard to get. And I think I did enough there. I'll get some tools ready. As long as I can find them when I need them. Okay, so let's give this a go. So I'm going to go on, take you on with me to the computer. And I need to go to Cricut Design Space. And I'd already opened it, but I'll do it. I'll start over for you. Okay. Okay, so I'm on Design Space. I am a monthly member. I don't use it enough to warrant that, but I don't like to have to go looking for, I'd lose a lot of my stuff. So, anywho, I'm going to go up here to, let's see if I can get you in here a little closer. Sorry if I'm bonking you around. Up here to the right to my stuff. And there you'll see I saved it. I labeled it banner, but I think... <laughs> Saved it twice. So um, I'm going to click on that because that's what I want to make. And I don't want to customize. I'm not changing anything. So I'm going to click on make it. Okay. If Without mat is when you have the um, smart vinyl. I don't, I'm not using that. I'm using a mat. Click on that. Confirm. All right, so here I've got, I'm just going to do one, and it shows me what I'm cutting out, and material size, eight and a half by, it doesn't matter, it says 12, but it doesn't matter. It, the machine itself will check it out for me, and then it goes through this thing where it says to continue, please connect, which I have. <laughs> it's finding the joy extra. Okay. So I have this, I've already saved it. It's called bookmarking it. Because you get, let me show you here. I hope you guys can see all this. Let me get closer here. Um, <clears throat> you can go through and find any materials that you want. You've got everything in here. So, but I've already saved what I wanted. I'm going to do glitter cardstock. Let's see where it says pressure. I want it more pressure because I just tried it before I came on here and it wasn't, so I want more. It just didn't come up, didn't cut as cleanly as I would like, so I can just add the pressure to it, okay? Because glitter cardstock is tricky. All right, I'm going to show you a machine. 
too high then you can't see it working okay so I'm gonna load it into <clears throat> excuse me so it senses the light on top is flashing okay that means it's ready to take my paper and I'm gonna slide it in there between the little holders and watch it just grabs it bada bing bada boom baby I should do an overhead but you know it is what it is Okay, so it's measuring the paper before, so it knows what it's working with, and now it's going to cut it out. So I believe the more means it's going to cut it twice. Okay, so that's waiting for me to hit while I'm yapping. On here, go. I don't know if you can see that either. There we go. So I'm going to click go. There's no buttons on the extra. It's all on your computer. So hit go. <coughs> it will cut it. You just set it and forget it. I love those rotisseries. <laughs> you can find them at what was it, Ron Popeil. I think it's going to do it twice. Or it just. get used to. I looked up banners and found one I liked. <clears throat> so it's done cutting. So now I get the unload green button. Again, it's all on your computer now for these two machines. And I am done cutting. So let's see how this one works. The last one did not come off good. Sorry, I hope I'm not making people sick by moving this all over. Okay, so yes 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 much better the last one it just then i spilled my palm <laughs> it's like lucy moment but remember <clears throat> when you're doing stuff like this it's just paper you just try it you gotta keep trying you're not gonna get better if you don't try do i sound like a teacher or what i don't know how to do it yet is what i used to tell the kids you can't do it yet all right Let's see not that pretty? So what I'm thinking is, I was cutting these little crowns out separate, and I was like, mm -hmm. A lot of times I'll do stuff like on white paper, the first sample one, so I get an idea of... I just kind of bend it, get it to peel away there, bend it back, and boom, it's coming off. Pretty good. It's very new matte, which you would think would be the greatest thing on earth, but it really is. It just makes it sticky, sticky. See what I'm doing. You have to see what I'm doing and then come up. Okay, here we go. So just peeling it off. I didn't take cocoa for a walk as it started just pouring. It should be better this afternoon, so I wanted to get a little of this done before I take her for a walk had to do a nappy, you know, the whole thing. Okay, so see that cut off much better, but I can still, I should pat this a little bit. I just pat it with my hand just to get it so it's not so sticky that your paper doesn't come off. Okay, now I gotta get off, I'm just taking off the bits and bobs. I like the portability. I, the maker is great when I'm doing shirts or, you know, it just depends on what you want it for. And I have it, so I'm not going to get rid of it. Right? Okay. So, I already cut out. Let's see what we think of this. Glitter paper is also hard to glue on. It doesn't adhere as well, but I cut some of these out. So, I'm thinking if I just do, oh yeah, baby. That, my friends, is the piece de la resistance. 
and a something, probably a little snag there. Okay, so I will do that. Oh, that's gorgeous. But I think I might do like foil or something, so I'll, we'll cut that out this piece here because it leaves this inner piece that I want to cut in a different color. Because why not? I've got all day. I, I, I'm gonna last, I have to be under pressure. Sorry, I'm turning away from you. I thought I saved foil paper. Let's see. Yep. But again, it's not gonna be. Maybe I'll just do that pink. I think I'll just do pink. What do you think? This <coughs> on the inside? Is that too... <laughs> what to do? What to do? I don't know. I don't know if I like that dark a pink. I'll be right back. I gotta go look at all my pink. God knows I have enough pink. I think I'm going to go with this lighter pink. To me, this is just too, too bright. So, I'll go back in my Cricut. I'm going to replace it on here. Just line it up with the top. Now, this is a different cardstock, so I'm going to have to replace. This is light, you know, like 60 pound. Probably they would consider a medium, I think. Because if you do the same as a glitter, it's going to come out all bumpy and snaky. <laughs> Those are my technical terms. <laughs> okay. All right. So let's go on here. Let's see what I find. So I'm done. I'm going to hit done here. And I think. I wanna, there we go. Okay. So I want to go on. I'm going to hit done. And I'm going to go back. Oops, okay, so let's see if this, okay, make it, sorry, I should have just stayed in there. Okay, nope, that's not what I want. Hmm. Customize, oh, maybe I just needed to hit customize, because I think I, okay, yeah. I just had this highlighted. I didn't have everything else highlighted. So I'm over here at the crown. See this here? Sorry. I don't use this enough to, I just know enough to be dangerous. Okay. Basic. That's what I'm doing. See how I, I hit? So see if you can see this. There is a uh, eyeball. But I had put to sleep the other ones, basically. So I want to find, this is the one I want. So I'm going to not highlight that one, not highlight that one. Just do this piece here. Come on. Oh. Good Lord. You guys are like, what is she doing? So put this one in the back, put this one in the back. Okay, so 12 attempts and I got it. Sorry about that. But this is the piece I want to cut now because I want the inside of it. All right? I want the inside of this piece. And I'm going to do it in this light pink. I keep it real. I don't do tons of editing, so you get to see me fumble around. Hopefully it makes you feel better about life. Okay, so we're going to... Recut this puppy, and this time I'm inserting. So now, before I can get it to flash and be ready, I have to hit make and I have to pick matte because that's what I'm cutting on. And now I need to, I've got that, so I'm ready for that. But here's where I need to go down to once it's I. It's annoying that it says connect every time because it's connected, people. Come on, work with me here. Okay, so I do not have bookmarked medium. So I'm going to go to popular. And you get these choices. And right here is medium. So I'm going to click on medium. Okay. And I, I don't think I need, I'm just using the default. I think it'll be fine because it's a lightweight paper. Okay. 
Now it's flashing. So we're gonna load it in there. So it grabs it, measures it out. There's probably a way I could just cut out the inside, but I don't know. So now it's saying click go on my computer which is right here. Again, I don't know if you can see that or not, but I want you to see the, com the, whole, the whole game here. Okay, click go, because the light is flashing, so I'm gonna hit go. And it'll go to town. Okay. Oh. All right, so now it's flashing again, and on my computer, I'm getting the signal to unload. I'm going to unload it. I'm going to take it out. Okay, so again, I don't want, I want it to be, I'm not using the outside, which maybe I'll reverse them. So I'll have two of each, and this will fit on there inside that. Okay, so here's, let's see what we got. Where's my other one? Here's that. I just cut it up. Anyway. <laughs> so, I will show you my first sample when I get it done. I'm done cutting, so now I just have to glue it together. All right, I have just wanted to come on and show I'm using the red line double stick tape this, I think, is from Timu. It's really, feels like gum. I mean, it's kind of funny. The top part is real rubbery. It's real rubbery, but it works well because when you have glitter paper, you know, it doesn't adhere as well, so I'm going to use the red line tape on that. Okay, so here's my first banner piece. I do not recommend, this stuff is really hard to work with, and it's thick tape, so it kind of elevates. I just... Not a fan. So I ended up using something I got, I think, from scrapbook.com, one of theirs, and hopefully it holds. I think that turned out really good. I just wanted to break down the glitter here so that the letters showed up. So there you go. I'll show you the banner when it is done. All right, we're going to head out and go get Miss Coco for some playtime. I think it's done raining for a little while. A little nippy. My spring gnome. <laughs> I even have gnomes in the car. All right, let's go get the mail. Okay, it's not raining. That's good. Happy about that. All these houses are exactly the same. I've lived on five acres, so this just, they're so close, but this is not as close as some can be. Oh my gosh. I don't know. All right, let's see what we got. Maybe we got a package. Hmm. Oh, I got a key. I get so excited. First time using a key though, you know how that goes. There we go. Is it for me? Nope. Oh yes, it is. Kimbo Creation. So cute. Alright. Now we'll go get Coco. Okay, we're out for our walk. I'm gonna try walking her first. Hi, Coco. Say hi. 
Say hi. Come on. Say hi for girls. Good girl. Good job. She's looking around. We don't usually go this way, so I think she's confused. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the smells. Oh my goodness. So lots of woods here, but it's supposed to be eventually a middle school. Poor animals. The poor wildlife have nowhere to go. This town is growing so fast. Oh, gonna get some water. When I started in the district, there were three elementaries. Now there's seven, I think. Uh -huh. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. So quit raining. Better time for a walk. I do clip her in the front. That seems to really help. Control. Make up your mind, sweeter. sweetie. Let's go. Walk. She's <laughs> gone. Does not like that thing. Eh, my goodness. I don't blame you, but you're hard to control, my dear. Got to do some sniffing. Well, people got a litter. One of these times I'm going to take a... Nope, 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 nope. We don't need that. That's not for girls. Bring a bag and clean up litter. It drives me nuts. Emma says when she becomes president someday, she's going to really put people in jail for littering. She's really mad about it. <laughs> so cute. I miss her. They're off watching the eclipse in Illinois, Carbondale. One of the best places to see it. Her parents live there. so That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Okay, so I did the word happy. Oh my gosh. And I don't know. I might have to go back with some tape. I'll bring tape with me the day of the party or whatever on my trip. I'm only there for two nights, so the kids are feeling bad about that and want me to come back some other time. And I'm like, yeah, but you're five hours away. Anyway, I had to use a capital P there. <laughs> and a Y. So there's so far. And then I'm going to do... I, I just... I, I don't want to have to go by... Let's see. I need... Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is that going to be tacky? Is anybody going to care, do you think, that some of them... A couple of them are different tones? I just don't want to have to go buy a whole pack of paper for two things. So I got that, and then I'm doing those with this. See, this is a light purple. And then this will be a dark purple with the pink in the middle. Isn't that pretty? <laughs> but yeah, it's, I don't know. I don't know. I want to do it the best I can. So, and then I've got all these cut out. I will say the extra, I don't know if it's me. I've had to order more um, mats. They get curled, and I don't know. It's probably the way I'm loading it or something. I don't know. So, but on Amazon, there's other companies besides Cricut selling them, and you get like three for the price of one from Amazon. So, there's that. Man, I don't know. Anyway, I'll decide. And then, oh, and then I'm going to do <clears throat> Tori. Use punch holes in these. And uh, maybe do different colors so it kind of makes sense up above. And just turn these into little banners for the name, for her name, Tori. And, um, yeah, and then put five. She's turning five. That shouldn't be happening. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for the day. Thanks for coming along with me today and joining me and seeing me put makeup on. I don't know. Is that weird? <laughs> I'm weird, so there you go. You never know what I'm going to do. Anyway, I did, like I said, I went to, I didn't film, I don't film in stores or anything. And I'm still not thinking about, oh, I should show the store I'm at or this whole thing of um, 
you know, what is it called? What am I doing here? I was going to say yoga. No, I'm tired. Um, you know, these vlogs. That's it. Jeez, wizards. I need to eat some dinner. Anyway, it's new to me, so I don't think about doing that all the time. But I had fun, and I hope you did too. And I hope you have a great day and evening, and I'll talk to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.